What's going on you guys? This is MXKDI. I have another Dell Optiplex 790 small form factor. Upgrading the processor, so I'll show you how to do that. So remove the side cover panel. And uh, you're going to remove the optical drive. Disconnect the power SATA. Disconnect the hard drive cage. There's a caddy here. Disconnect the SATA power and remove the now there are four screws here use a Phillips screwdriver and this is the Optiplex 790 small foam factor I'm upgrading the processor, so I'll show you guys how to do that. So there'll be four screws, you get that disconnected, uh, remove the four screws. It's actually, they hold on to the heat sink, but uh, you're gonna disconnect right here the, for the fan, processor, fan right here, you get that, the cooler disconnect that. It's a four, it's a four pin, four power, disconnected. And, So we're gonna remove the heatsink fan and you're gonna wipe down the thermal compound here and uh, just right here but uh, we're gonna put install a new heat uh, new processor so remove the processor there's a little pin right here you're gonna press it to the right gently I'm just gonna zoom in the video and remove the processor Now, what I'm going to do is install the new processor. And the edge is going to be in the top. You see right here? Oh, we can't zoom in really close, but the, the top edge is right here. The little right here is going to be that's how you install the heat sink right here. The top goal edge that's going to be the top. Now, I'm going to take the heat sink and we're going to wipe down the thermal compound. Uh, you're gonna use a paper towel or using like a high quality paper towel you use you can buy it in your grocery store they sell it it's uh, pretty like a high end high quality use a more expensive paper towel just wipe it down dual thermal compound yeah, that's good enough If your doesn't come off really well, you can use 50% uh, rubbing alcohol to take off for the rest of the thermal compound. But mine's like it comes right off, so it's like new. Okay, now I'm gonna apply the thermal compound. I don't put too much on it, just in the middle. And spread it around. If you don't have this little, I got this from the memory, it's like a little, you could use it from, you could actually use the pad or, uh, or you could use a credit card, perfectly fine, to spread it and just wipe it off. You use a credit card, if you don't have any, like something like this, this spreads really easy, but you could use a credit card, perfectly fine. So I'm just going to spread it. You don't want to put too much on it because when you install the heat sink it will spread it evenly.
that's good enough now we're going to install back the heatsink first we're going to do connect the there will be holes right here you will see the we connect right here the edges right in the back you'll see the little bigger holes that's how you connect it right back and align it Connect the back the heat the, the processor here the heat sink the fan the processor fan cooler right here the four pin connect right back to the motherboard Okay, we installed back the heatsink fan. Now we're gonna reconnect the uh, install the hard drive cage here. Connect the SATA power. That'll be secure lock, press it to the right. Press it to the left, you're gonna release it, but press it to the right to lock it. Install the optical drive and connect it back to cables, say it in power. Now we're going to reinstall back the side cover panel. So this is it guys, end of the video. So we this is for Dell Optiplex 790, small phone factor, processor upgrade. Thanks for watching. Bye.